What's going on, y'all? Y'all now tuned in to Real Deal Fishing. I'm down here in Alamorada Key, in the Florida Keys. And today I'm gonna focus on something that most people normally don't target. I'm gonna be focusing on uh, parrotfish today. Uh, I was online and just saw a lot of people posting things online asking, you know, um, can you keep parrotfish? What's the bag limit, size limit, things of that nature. So um, I'm gonna show you guys how to catch a couple of parrotfish and uh, put some in your bucket. But um, for those of you who don't know, the, um, the size limit for parrotfish, they have to be 12 inches or under. They cannot be larger than 12 inches. And it's five per person. They're very good. Um, today, I'm going to be focusing on some parrotfish. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about. Down here in the water, you should be able to see the parrotfish along the water right here. And I'm gonna be using bread to catch parrotfish. Now just, Real quick, watch this. As I drop that bread in the water, you'll see them come up to the top right there. As you can see. So I'm gonna show you guys how to catch a pair of fish real quick. Ah, got him. Got a nice pair of fish on y'all. Ah, oh, yeah. He got on? No, he's on. You want me to? Uh -uh. Get my net. Oh, my God. Right, nice. Ooh. All right, guys. As you can see, that's on bread, people. Remember, they have to be. 12 and under. Now here's the thing when dealing with parrotfish. Uh, when dealing with these, you actually gotta keep them alive, guys. When you catch them, you gotta keep them alive. I'm gonna show you how you keep them alive. Now, because he's a tropical fish, you have to keep him alive at all times until it's time for him for you to go so what i do is i go get a little bag nice little laundry bag from the dollar store and i store them in the laundry bag until it's time to go only cost you a dollar slide them right in that bag right there zip it Put them right back in the water. And remember, they have to be 12 inches and under. And you gotta keep them alive until it's time to go because they're considered tropical fish. Got them. Nice parrot fish. Take them. I'm about to get caught in the rain, folks, so I gotta rush with this. You take them and put them in a nice little bag and keep them in the water until it's time to go. Here's what I do. Take a nice little mesh bag, like you see here. Cost a dollar. Put your fish in and drop them in there until it's time for you to go. Just a shot of the daily catch. A couple of snappers and three pair of fish, as you can see. They're all 12 inches and under. All in all, we had a pretty good day. Um, got kind of hot, so we had to shut down early. But I hope the uh, information that was given to you today can be helpful. I hope you guys can put a couple of parrotfish in your bucket i hope it puts an end to all the questions that you guys have again remember parrotfish have to be at least 12 inches and under 
can only keep five per person. And I hope you put some in your bucket, man. Thanks for tuning in to Real Deal Fishing.